Here's another episode of what it's like to go to war. This time I want to talk about fear. And I kind of think I actually need to do several of these videos about fear because war is the ultimate terrifying experience. If you think about it, war is kill or be killed. And there should be an insane amount of fear that goes along with that. And there are different types of fear that happen to you in war. And really what I think I'd like to do in the next several episodes is talk to you about those types of fear. Some of that fear is based on the unknown. I just have no idea what to expect. You do your best to plan, you try to prepare, you try to anticipate, but in the long run, just like the great Mike Tyson once said, everybody has a plan until they get punched in the face. And most famous warriors will tell you, you go to war with a plan, but the plan goes out the window when the first bullet goes over your head. So there's the fear of the unknown. We'll talk about that some more. There is the fear of certain death. And I really think that it's only a rational human being that would really grasp the fear that I may not live to see the sun come up tomorrow. And in other words, what I'm saying is there's something seriously wrong, sick in the head with somebody who says, I've gone to war and I wasn't afraid at all. Like I call BS on that or else you just need to go to a, a room with some uh, padding on the walls. And then there's the fear of letting down your buddies. And to be honest, these three fears can sometimes work in concert with each other. The fear of the unknown on top of the fear of letting your buddies down on top of the fear of I may not see it tomorrow and fear stacked on top of fear on top of fear. Sometimes those fears will cancel each other out. For example, you are more terrified of letting your buddies down than you are what the enemy might do to you and therefore I focus on what I do more than I focus on what the enemy does. What I'm trying to say in this video is war is entirely about managing fear and most of the people that have spent a lot of time in war will tell you war can be weeks or months of intense boredom and then moments of insane amounts of fear. I've done a video on this in the past in my Black Hawk Down fun fact videos. Sometimes that boredom can just get overwhelming. And then all of a sudden, all of those events happen and you're in the thick of it and every possible fear is on top of your shoulders. You're in what the President Theodore Roosevelt experienced with the Rough Riders on San Juan Hill as his crowded hour where all of the planning and all of the preparations and the months of boredom all became one crowded hour of insane fear. Yeah, war is all about managing and mitigating fear. There's no way that I could cover all of the fear that you're gonna experience going to war in just one video. So what I think I'd like to do is do a couple of follow-up videos to this about the fear of the unknown, about the fear of the enemy, about the fear of letting your buddies down, about the fear that I may not see the sun come up or I am certain I won't see the sun come up tomorrow and how you conduct yourself in all of those circumstances. So if you wanna know what's universally true of all wars, all times, all over the planet, it's managing and living with fear. Just a thought for you about what it's like to go to war. Stay tuned for more information about what I mean by these different types of fear. See you next time.